last five years, but she is an amazing woman and she is very, very kind to everybody she meets and very straightforward in what she does and we want to celebrate the business meeting as a whole at our NASFIC. We have a Westercon business meeting and hopefully we'll have a NASFIC site selection as well as Westercon, so we need the very best. Um, we will have information at the site selection tables. The conversion rates are in the progress report. If you have any questions, my whole team has been briefed and we will help you convert and hopefully you will come celebrate all these exciting things in Utah with us next year. Thank you, Kate. Are there any questions here for Kate? Seeing none, thank you. And we will move on to the Worldcon site selection. Yes. Kevin Stanley. <laughs> no, I'm not. I'm not commenting on that. Although I am very. Uh, I'm delighted to be able to ha have the tag team fan guests of honor up there, getting, keeping the old team together. But, Mr. Chairman, uh, I uh, ask unanimous consent to thank the tellers for their work and instruct them to destroy the ballots. Yeah. Seeing none, so granted. Warren. <laughs> and of course, we had a Worldcon site selection to administer as well. I do have the results from that. We had a total of 726 ballots cast. There were 33 no preference, leaving 693 expressing a preference. Eight of these were for none of the above. Uh, we had single po votes come in for Aotearoa in 2020, Bimenzana Wakanda, El Fabuloso Bungalow, Glugs Chalet, Grantville, West Virginia, John Sapiens's Yard, Marsopolis, Minneapolis in 74, <laughs> Slab City, and Tonopah, Nevada. We had two votes for Olive Country, two for Minneapolis in 73, three for Zerps, three for Peggy Ray's House, 22 for Christmas in Boston 2020, and 643 for New Zealand. <laughs> As we needed 347 for a majority, New Zealand has won the World Cup. Would someone from New Zealand care to make a presentation, please? Certainly. <laughs> or someone's? Yep. <laughs> um, we'll just, we're just going to set up our, our video presentation and so on. Um, you may have all heard the story in 2010 when somebody auctioned me off and said, hey, Norman, run. we want you to run a Worldcon in 2020. Um, which is, and so, that happened, um, <laughs> and that's been a direct. This has all been a direct result of that. But some of you may not be aware that in 2004, I was the Duff delegate at NorEastCon 4 in Boston, and there, at the end of the convention, in an emotionally heightened state and vulnerable, let me just say, <laughs> I, I expressed the um, I expressed the idea that I would love to have a Worldcon in New Zealand. And there were four people sitting around that table that promptly gave me twenty dollars. <laughs> <laughs> I did not know this was a um, <laughs> th this was a thing. <laughs> However, I actually put those twenty dollars in this notebook with their names, and that was <coughs> Vince Doherty, James Bacon, <laughs> Andrew Adams, and T.R. <laughs> and they are all here. <laughs> For their sins, they are helping out. <laughs> right, um, we're going to uh, play a video, and I'm going to go and sit back there to, in order to play the video. Um, if you will indulge us one moment, thank you. I'm not sure if the sound is turned up. <laughs> it works. <laughs> It lives. Press play. Stretch down. Stretch down. <laughs> <laughs> 
Can we get louder here? Put the microphone to it. Put the microphone to it. Stop the video. No audio. Where's that coming out of? It's only coming out of, this, out of the, the player over here. Oh. Um, you set the earphone jack for your, your preferences. Sorry. Thank you. Now, here we go. Sorry, take two. <laughs> take two this small. There I was at a convention in 2010, and someone voluntold me to start a bid for a New Zealand Worldcon. And before I knew it, people were throwing money at me. <laughs> But New Zealand just seems like a silly idea. Nothing cool has ever happened here. <laughs> it's gloomy and ugly. And especially not Wellington, it's got dangerous creatures. Nobody cool would want to come. It might be raining and cold. Actually, that last bit might actually happen. <laughs> and besides, we'll get no support from anyone. Kia ora everyone, and can I say a huge thank you to the World Science Fiction Society for confirming Wellington, New Zealand for the 78th World Con in 2020. Uh, I am New Zealand's Prime Minister Jacinda Ardern and I wanted to extend my personal invitation for all of you to come to Wellington, New Zealand and enjoy World Con here. Well, if we could persuade anyone to come, what would they be looking forward to? And what is with this music? Oh, really? They did? Okay. Well, let's do this thing. It's been a long road, um, and I wanted to say um, tēnā koutou to everyone that's Māori for thank you to a group of people, a large group of people, uh, because this is... <laughs> 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 this is why we have somebody to speak for us. Um, all right, I probably knew this was going to happen. Anyway, sorry. Um, but. Okay, no. Uh, I've, I think I've said everything we need to say. Um, we'd like to hand out a progress report zero, please. Um, and we would like to take questions now, if you have any, other than stop <laughs> bluffing.